Former Secretary Clinton became the first woman nominated for president by a major party. Earlier this month, you said she doesn't have, quote, a presidential look. She's standing here right now. What did you mean by that? Uh, she doesn't have the look. She doesn't have the stamina. I said she doesn't have the stamina. And I don't believe she does have the stamina. To be president of this country, you need tremendous stamina. The quote was, you I have, just don't think wait, she wait, has wait a Wait a minute, unless you ask me a question. Did you ask me a question? You have to be able to negotiate our trade deals. You have to be able to negotiate, that's right, with Japan, with Saudi Arabia. I mean, can you imagine we're defending Saudi Arabia and with all of the money they have, we're defending them and they're not paying? All you have to do is speak to them. Wait, you have so many different things you have to be able to do, and I don't believe that Hillary has the stamina. Let's let her respond. Well, as soon as he travels to 112 countries and negotiates a peace deal, a ceasefire, a release of dissidents, an opening of new uh, opportunities in nations around the world, or even spends 11 hours testifying in front of uh, a congressional committee, he can talk to me about stamina. The world, <laughs> let me tell you, let me tell you, Hillary has experience. But it's bad experience. We have made so many bad deals during the last... So she's got experience, that I agree. But it's bad, bad experience. Whether it's the Iran deal that you're so in love with, where we gave them $150 billion back, whether it's the Iran deal, whether it's uh, anything you can... Name, you almost can't name a good deal. I agree. She's got experience, but it's bad experience. And this country can't afford to have another four years of that kind of experience. We are